Fora TV. The world is thinking. But the president's made very clear, especially in this speech in Prague, that um, that we want to get back to what's what we all call the high ground. Um, the United States is a signatory to the Non-Proliferation Treaty. Article 6 of the Non-Proliferation Treaty says that those states that have nuclear weapons will go to zero. The ambition is to go to zero. So you hear out in the debate um, lots of people um, on, on the far side of one party that will say how dangerous and how irresponsible it is for the president to talk about going to zero on nuclear weapons. Ladies and gentlemen, we signed that treaty a long time ago. We've said we were going to do that. The question is, as the rest of the world watches, are we actually going to do it? Are we actually going to look like we're doing it? That's optics. Optics, pitch, and tone. Are we actually going to start to do the things that say that we are going to do it? That's why the follow-on treaty to start negotiations for the Russians is very, very important. Um, we have the two largest arsenals. Um, we have got to say to people that have ambitions and aspirations to have nuclear weapons, hold it, hold it, hold it. We're going down. There's no reason for you to be threatened by us. We're going down. Um, at the same time, we have a very strong conventional force. We have a conventional military, and we have conventional armaments that we can use that are enormously precise and very, very effective. Should we find ourselves in a place where the president, as commander in chief, decides he must use them? So the idea that, that Barack Obama or his administration is looking to weaken the United States, that's not true. What he's decided to do, as he says in his Prague speech, is to live up to our commitments and to lead the world away from these very, very dangerous weapons. Because the more there are of them, the less able we are to, say, to safeguard them and protect them. That's the simple fact. And since we have the most, we should be the ones that are visibly doing the best we can to make sure that we are not only safeguarding them, but that we are taking them down. And taking them down, I mean destroying them. I don't mean putting them on blocks in a garage, which is what the Bush administration did in the last, in the last few years. Um, you have to destroy them. And so we have to do things that very visibly show that we understand what our commitments are, that we once again are going to lead the world in this effort that we are, our partner, Russia, and others were going to work together. So I think the President's agenda, if you read the Prague speech, is very clear. He is a man who is committed, taking an oath to do it, to protect the American people. But at the same time, the proliferation of these weapons is enormously dangerous. It is uncontrollable at some level. It is the wrong direction, and that we're going to lead in the effort to make sure that we are not making the world less safe because we haven't done what we promised to do, which is to have a, a weapons stockpile that is being reduced responsibly.